Oh, I thought you'd be long gone. Yeah, went for a walk. Sorry I didn't stick around to talk to you and Rona. She understands the pressure you're under. But she doesn't think Sarah's family are racists. Maybe she just doesn't see it. She's known them a long time. <laughs> so I'm imagining it. The profiling, the wall of silence, the fact the whole thing stinks. I didn't say that. But you need to find a way to let go of this rage. It's not good for you. You think I want to feel like this? Have everyone look at me like I'm a, a walking stereotype? Is that the drug dealer or the angry young black man? Don't. I, I have a right to be angry. And where's it getting you? I've been there myself, you know that. You're gonna have to learn to pick your battles, however wrong that is. It's just how the world works, for now at least. You've been spouting that same rubbish all my life and you know, I I'm sick of it. You got caught up in something which is of no fault of your own. We both know it's not right, but now you're gonna have to find a way to rise above it. Oh, please don't start talking about forgiveness. It's got a lot going for it. And if you keep on like this, you're gonna exhaust yourself, burn yourself out. It's not gonna happen, Dad. I've seen it happen too many times. Good people, passionate people. The exact people we need if we're ever gonna see the changes we've spent so long waiting for. So learn to control that anger. Make the best use of it. Time for a quick chat. Yeah, it wasn't Danny, by the way. You can check if you want. No, no, it's fine. I trust you. I spoke to a mate earlier about Ethan. I thought that was all sorted. Well, it's not, though, really, is it? Look, I didn't mean for him to get in trouble. And he's a solicitor. The police have no evidence on him. So it's not like he's going to end up in prison, is it? Can't we just leave it? No, Sarah, it's not that simple. Yes, it is. So whoever your friend is, just tell him to butt out. It's about doing the right thing. We have got to face up to this. Ethan's done nothing wrong, and yet he's the one that's suffering. People see him, Sarah, and they see a black guy that's been pushing drugs. Yeah, but it's not about race. No, not to us, it's not. Yeah, well, I didn't pick his jacket on purpose, and I didn't make that copper single him out. Sarah, people are judging him. OK, he's the one that's having to deal with the fallout. It's not right. Come on, you are brave enough to deal with this. Right, well, what would I have to do? You have to talk to him. You need to apologise, and whatever happens, I will be by your side, I promise you. OK, can I go upstairs now? Yeah. Sure. Just, um, I'm gonna nip out, okay? I won't be long. Okay. Oh, hey, Rona. Who knew it'd be so hard to arrange a day, eh? Well, to actually end up on one. All my fault, obviously. Maybe them dating gods. We'll try again soon, though, yeah? Sorry about this. Sarah doesn't want to go out. Well, I didn't ask her. Because uh, she's going to speak to Ethan tomorrow and tell him the truth, so I, I just feel like I want to be with her.